Yo. Adios, amigos, is probably not the first thing somebody says to introduce a bit of gaming, <laughs> but uh, the last thing maybe. The title of the game, obviously. Uh, let's have a look at the trailer. Serious astrophysics, eh? Looks good. Team up with your friends and family and explore the peculiar universe of Adios, a game of serious astrophysics, game setting from one to four players. I don't know if that's online multiplayer or not. We'll find out in a second. Um, I played another game very similar to this. I just can't remember for the life of me what it was called. Um, could probably find it out but yeah it very similar look it was more of a um rpg though than like a, a physics a 2d physics sim type game it's a 2018 title it's only a gigabyte download space in adios amigos the simulation controls everything nudge an asteroid with your ship and it might come crashing down on you as you walk around on a planet minutes later Day and night cycles are caused by the planet's rotations, and we even simulate temperature and air resistance. Wow. The player is free to do anything within the confines of the simulation. You can spontaneously exit the ship inside a busy asteroid field, fly to the sun and melt your ship, tow a giant mushroom and put it in orbit around the sun, ride a sofa into a black hole. Only your feet, failures and imagination have set the limits, all right? This might scratch that sort of Kerbal Space program which I've got. With Rookie Mode, it's possible for players of different skill levels to play together. Parents can play with young children, or gamers can play with their less talented parents and siblings. We want the whole family to be able to play Adios Amigos together. Rookie Mode makes the controls easier and stops the player from doing obviously dangerous things. Okay, cool. So it has got local multiplayer. It has got shared and split screen and an Xbox local co-op as well. Oh, let's have a look at some of these screen shots. Right, so that's the split screen. Okay. I mean, it sounds good to me. Better than one I thought. Not worth the money. £12.49, but again, I would have bought it on sale. I presume there was like 80% off, so it was £2.50 maybe. I don't know. Wouldn't have cost much. Adios, amigos. Oh, I forgot to paste the link to that guy's video, actually. I'm just going to quickly do that while this is loading up, hopefully. Um, Okay, that's done. Right. What's helping option? <laughs> that's a weird noise. Hmm? 
<laughs> oh, you know what? If I if that was the sound of flatulence, I would not be ashamed to do that in public. What's huge TV mode? Oh. I mean, I have got huge TV, so should I do it in that mode? We'll see what it see what the difference is like later. Bit dark. I can only restore from the backup. I'm losing all flight data, a bit lost in space then. I must have booted from a backup. Security alert. Live form detected. Oh, you seem to be my pilot. I'm Zing, your ship's navigation computer. No, I will not tell you the acronym, what the acronym stands for. It's embarrassing. I am required by emergency regulations to give you flight instructions. Push L in the direction you want to fly and hold RT to burn with the thruster. The ship will automatically rotate and align with L. Remember, this up is always up. It's very sensitive. want me to go somewhere. Interesting flying technique. Do not take this wrong way, but please mind the ships repair indicator it would be very nasty and painful for both of us if it was to be destroyed also when you use the thruster you spend energy if we run out of energy we are doomed stranded scrap metal done for game over and so on spend that with care speaking about doomed i seem to have lost our position when i was recovered from backup i need more data to establish where we are so you will need to do some exploring fly close to things that pulsate to scan them discoveries give us star points and they are added to the top left star meter Trying to burn that. Okay, smooth flying now. But there's one to burn. There's another one.
we have we lapped the planet? I think we have, you know. Okay, time to. When the top left meter is filled, I have enough data to plot a Z jump to another solar system. Each time we Z jump, we will move one light year closer to home. The key to finding a home is to travel as many light years as possible. Let us try Z jump. Fly into space and press A to initiate the jump drive. I don't know what the rate of fuel burn is. Oh. Is that my trajectory? Like, can I can I just try and get into an or orbit? I mean, if I burn retrograde now, that should tighten my orbital path. Why, why am I not? Okay, that's just A. Keep this journey going and we're going to need some energy. We're currently out of it. Try landing on one of those small pulsating items. Try landing on them. Collect some cargo items before the meter reaches zero. Each thrust burn costs energy. Additional star data to pilot the Z jump. You need to explore the second planet in this solar system. But first, I'll show you a couple of neat things that will help you. You can zoom out. Oh, that's sweet. Use it to manually zoom in and out. Indicates manual zoom mode. LT to fast forward time, the faster time will flow. How it works. It's mostly placebo. <laughs> okay. Right, cool. So I should be in a faster orbit. Okay. So to get to that second planet, there's no time like the present, really. Manually zoom in and out. Okay, done that. It's still... What's, what's this cloud here? Crown using R. Now, turn automatic cameras back on. Right to the second planet in the solar system. Tip, launch from the night side of the planet and you will avoid launching into the sun. Well, I'm just thinking, are there any more resources? There are. this here something down here as well I 
Okay. I need to know. I need to get into orbit then of that second planet. When I'm grav locked to that planet. Oh, okay. Yeah, it looks like my orbit. Okay, I'm not. I'm not in the most perfect little orbit but that we, there we go we're in orbit now it, it will degrade but if I wait till I get to that apoapsis right and then I push out I burn prograde which is most efficiently done on the apoapsis 90 degrees okay let's just bring look at that so now although my orbits yeah that planet will take o overtake me quicker I mean the only difficulty is I'm gonna have to burn retrograde to catch up with that planet or I could just take a larger orbit Look, I'm going to slingshot here. What I don't want to do is end up trapped in that planet's gravitational path. That slingshot, well, it's not a slingshot, but... I should drift into that real close proximity to the sun now okay that's a bit scary but let's burn prograde now That looks about right to me. Just slightly. So I'm going to push out my orbit now. Oh no no! I think I think that was bang on actually. Retrograde. Why is my orbit doing that? What am I slingshotting around there? That's almost like, that looks to me like I've got trapped in the gravitational pull of something, but what? Well, I don't know. Yes, I have. Look. So, I mean, that planet's gravitational pull. If I can just maintain, I should, 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 should. Whoa, that was close. Is there a drive online? Let's get some more cargo then. It's not got a lot of fuel. Okay, so finally, a game with genuine orbital mechanics. Orbital mechanics aren't, well, I don't think they're that difficult to get your head around. Once, if you've, if you've got a decent tutorial, once you've got them, you've got them. Do you know what I mean? Like, let's wait till we're on the dark side then. Boom. Away we go. Z jump in three, 
two, one. So, I think oh, I'm just trying to remember the name of the game. The, the the other game was like a game of trying to work your way back to Earth. In fact, I've had a few. Is it FTL Faster Than Light that was like that as well? Mm. No, that's trying to escape some alien onslaught. Airlock. Just enjoy my tea for a moment. Learn how to use the airlock because some things can tragically only be handled from outside the ship. Like that pulsating fossil rock over there, it can only be scanned up close by using the portable scanner. That is why I have marked it with a thingy. This means that you need to deal with this discovery outside of the ship. We are quite a team, you and I, and I just wanted you to know that. That sounds like the sort of thing a psycho AI would say, doesn't it? I say things that might come across as mean from time to time, but that is just my faulty social circuit speaking. I'm going to use that excuse in life. Please do not run away from me when I unlock the airlock. Press Y to exit the ship. Ship's in a bit of a bad state. Okay, I've touched that object. Keep exploring the planet on foot. Jump with A. Is it like, have I got a rocket boost? I like being able to traverse the entire planet on foot. Oh. Portal Spagana will mark it with, and you'll need to deal with this discovery. Bring it to the ship. How? It's also possible to aim and throw cargo using R and RB in front of you just by using RB. Limit possi limitless possibilities for fuel savings by manual cargo loading. Trust me, you need the workout. I have senses. <laughs> Seems that you cannot get back to the ship. Do not worry. I'm an excellent pilot myself. Fly the ship remotely. Pick yourself up. Toggle Y to toggle between the ship and yourself. Oh, that's so cool. yourself up you want into the ship if you stand close to it and press Y I was never worried that you would leave me psycho AI be careful outside the ship things like high temperatures and meteors can do horrible things to you horrible things will affect your heart meter if something horrible has happened get back inside the ship as soon as you are safe inside the ship's auto dock can heal and that's trademarked it seems like you still have some bruises since after the crash hold B to heal yourself with the ship auto dock healing cost fuel Where's my healing? Oh. Now to the real reason why I'm letting you go outside, the ship needs repairing. <laughs> I'm not blaming you for this, because that would obviously go against my programming. Listen carefully and I will teach you how to repair the ship. Press Y to exit the ship. 
Repair all the damage to the ship's hull. Hold B next to the ship to repair. Repairing costs fuel. So it's all energy, then, basically. Gotta be careful about that. Wonderful. The signs of you know who's piloting abuse are gone. The hull is pristine condition once again. Please keep it that way since even the slightest damage to it can be fatal at high velocities. That is it, really. Personally, I'm looking forward to having this ship all by myself when you are running around outside. This concludes the mandatory emergency flight instructions. You can imagine this is a HAL 9000, can't you? Open the pod bay doors, please, Hal. Enter the ship by standing close to it and pressing Y. Open the pod bay doors, please, Hal. Wait, you want me to come back in again? Press A to initiate the Z jump drive and exit the solar system. I like this music. It reminds me of a game's music that I was playing recently and I keep I can't remember what game it was, but I loved the music. It was just really simple. Dun, 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 dun. Let's see if we can smash this orbital mechanic again. Burn prograde in a second. I'll wait till. That should be it, really. I don't understand why it's not. I mean, it doesn't tell me what my velocity is, but for some weird reason. Is, why is my orbit always decaying? It shouldn't always be decaying. Look, it's always decaying. I could get it if I was. But it decays dramatically. Right. Apoapsis. Burn. Perpendicular. Oh, no. Overburned. I don't like that. I, I I don't know how that's going to work for fuel consumption. Well, it's just going to mean that I can't just get into a a nice circular orbit and conserve fuel. Wait, what's going on here? Burp. Ship's log.
I can't change any of that. Um, okay. I'm a little person. I'm a mini person. Mini person with a mini... No, actually I've got an enormous head. Mushroom. Mushroom. Oh. Mini person. With a mini torch. I'm on the dark side of the planet now. It's minus 40 degrees Celsius. I won't let this ship run out of fuel. Who's this geezer? Signs of alien life over here. this guy a bit of thrust he's causing a bit of havoc isn't he Let me have that pair. Not sure about that alien. close to the planet. Would have been nice to check out that asteroid as well, actually. There's another alien. There's aliens all over the place. Are we on this? Look at that. Get off my ship. 
Where's he gone? They run fast, don't they, those aliens? I've pra I can practically jump into orbit. Hasn't been worthwhile coming to the, see this planet. Actually, I'll have to say, stop knocking my ship. Although, let's get into a bit of that asteroid there. See what there is to see. Wait, what the hell has happened here? I'm going to count myself lucky. Right, just keep an eye on the fuel. <gasps> Look at the asteroid field there. What's this here? Stabilize its orbit. Make it a little bit more eccentric so it can do some damage in this solar system. So we've managed to visit two planets. I think. I think we'll wait for that planet to orbit round to us, that very inner planet. And then we should, in theory, start speeding up as we drop towards the sun. Oh, we're going to miss it. There we go. Is it actually a planet? There we go. Cool. Stonehenge planet. So get out and have a walk around, eh? Is my fuel good? I do with pushing that big rock off. What's this down here? What's this thing? What is it, though? Oh, what was that? It was like an asteroid collision. What was it?
It was. Was that the asteroid I pushed in space, I wonder? It doesn't look like it, does it? That was a little bit more knobbly. All right, we're definitely going to launch on the dark side, away from the solar system star. Let's get that Z jump in spooled up. Sweet. Now, we've got a planet to look forward to. We've got an asteroid field to look forward to. Let's get that planet. Oh, that, that thing there has not got a circular orbit by the looks of things, but oh well. Hey, I'm not criticising. In fact, there's quite a few eccentric orbits in this system. Come on, planet, catch up with me. You know what, actually? That thing's orbit's probably going to decay. Let's try and get on board of it. I'm going to guesstimate that that's a good little intercept. set that orbit now. It's going way too fast. took an impact then. Now how can can I dock with this? Oh it's it's actually thrusting, it's stabilizing its own orbit somehow. I can. I've docked. Well sort of. Let's just leave my as long as I'm tethered I'm alright surely. this here? Is that not an airlock? So I it's actually got some gravity on this thing. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Has he not got any magneto boots? Can I not get on board this then? <gasps> Don't want to be. It's it's got a much more powerful thruster than I have. Do 
do not want to get in the face the full that in the face do I there we go that looks like a dock what is it there's a little light source coming out of it oh oh so good what have we got here all sorts of things there's a suite over there Lampshade. We'll take that. We'll, we'll 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 have that back in the aircraft. Guys, oh, it's rickety this station, isn't it? We are scanning scanning mayhem isn't it I'm just trying to look at my fuel I'm okay oh look at the oh the ship is in a right state being flung around At the st oh no, that might have been from the from the landing. I'm sort of stuck here at the moment. Can't get into that. Area over there. I'd like to know how. We've got anything else in the other two? wasn't prepared to find the oh no let go of it I'm going to let that go that that looks interesting You know what? Something makes more sense. Right. Let's grab onto something. So I'm secure. Let's grab onto this. Right. Let's autopilot this ship. Maneuvering thrusters only. So I've actually only got one thruster. It's, it's, it's everything. Now. Let's line up. I 
I'll not go into that entrance. Or is that not the entrance? That's not the entrance, is it? There's the entrance down there. Oh, you don't maneuver. Oh, you... done this right? Not really. This is going to be horrific. Get out, let's get out, let's get out. Grab something. Run. I need to run out. Come on. Stop that thruster. I don't know why it decayed so much. Missed it, bloody hell. Absolutely missed it, never mind. What's this down here? That looks like a big egg. I'm putting that in the ship. I can do about that. I'll leave it there. Take that. There's not much in the way of fuel on this planet, is there? Wait, what was that? Something glowing over there. What is it? I think I've got 
what I need. Got really far away from that planet, didn't we just then? What's up here? Oh, another space station. try not to do is mess up this one's orbit I mean like I haven't seen its thrusters firing so I presume it's either non-operational or in a relatively stable orbit but where we are doesn't look like a stable orbit what's that over there got to remember that Right, as quick as I can then. Let's get on board. Where's the entrance? That's the th question. Down here. Doesn't look like it. Big battery thing here. And a huge circuit board, Z Drive Online. No, it's it's firing its thrusters. this thing. Come on. Oh, this is not good again. Let's let go of it. Oh, sugar. Oh, actually then. Apart from that thing likely to explode we're all right okay that doesn't sound good does it but wait where am i okay Okay, all right, we're okay. So, let's go and get some fuel off this thing here.
get back in. Let's get out of here. Crikey. Is there anything else here that's knocking around that we can have? Give that a repair now. What's this thing here? Oh! How the hell do I get out of this asteroid field? Everything's decaying into the sun. Okay, flipping heck. Can't believe it. Absolutely. Now, somewhere along here, there was a very interesting thing. Where is it? Uh, speed things up. See if we can... Don't want to be hitting that asteroid then. Well, well even though saying that, I've just... understand which way that asteroid field is orbiting the sun. Where's that alien device that something interesting but I can't see it now maybe it's smashed up should have gone to it first look at all the asteroids come like smashing into that planet now it's absolutely bombarded Everything so far seems to be orbiting its sun in a clockwise direction. That thing there, it's flashing that beacon. That's rendezvous. Sort of chasing it the wrong way. Okay, this is fast.
the hell is this thing? Get the hell out of here. 400 for that. There's still something on that planet. It's it's like pinging at me. Boom. I don't like the look of those asteroid classes. Crashes. it pinging at me this is dangerous isn't it being here what's this thing where is it oh god that was close Get right this quickly. There it is. That's what it was. Get this repaired. Get on board. Spool up that Z drive. a jump hmm. right that was a bit manic I'll try and be a little bit more controlled let that planet catch up It'll take a while and slow maintain that orbit looking about right for an interception no maybe a little bit more prograde how's that looking there we go soft landing nice soft landing okay look how sensitive this stick is oh come on craft right there we go now can we I'm going to regret that. What's this thing down here? Huh. Z drives on mine just from that.
Come on. What's this down here? Am I stuck? Well, there's a lesson. Where's the ship? Get me up later. Such low gravity on this planet. Really went into orbit. Something over here that looked interesting. Yeah. What have we got over here? Nothing. to get to. Looks like I've I've been affected by its gravity somehow, so there we go. Hey, come on. Another Get this keg of beer on board. It's good. It's looking like fuel energy is back up. Come on. 
come on. That's it. Just come off the end there. Give me enough space. There we go. So what have we got in here? What's this? 700. That's quite a lot, actually. When you think, like, what I did to get to that one that was like, oh, I'm stuck. Push that one off. Actually, that was a lot easier doing that. Than pulling. This is glowing down here as well. I don't suppose I need every single thing on this planet. Exactly what I was hoping for. Out of thingy. See how much that's was worth. Was it worth it? Was ten. Ten fuel. I can't see anything. I've done those two planets. Let's go, Z jumping. Mm, two light years. Temperature was getting cold. Right, I'll be right back. I'm just, I'm, I'm getting a bit of a headache. I think I need water.
that was the world's largest glass of water. Now I had to do a few bits and bobs, but let's crack on. So, planet up there, it's escaping me. Not if I burn. Okay, my approach is quite close. It's quite fast, I mean. Ooh. Oh, what's this bad boy here? Discovered a ship. I can't use that ship. Can I? Can I push it? towards my ship can I not do anything with it now I don't know what that is come on 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 right Hello? Boom. What is that? Doesn't matter. Is that? That was almost dead onto the ship, wasn't it? I think I will push. I'll oh, grab this one here. Wow, look at that throw. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's just see if it's quicker to run. A little bit. I knew that was going to happen. Let's just leave that for a second. Tree. It's that massive egg thing. What is it? Oh, fancy that crushing the ship. Finding loads of bits and bobs. <laughs> Look at it. It's gone off into space. That alien rock thing with eyes. <laughs> That's so cruel, isn't it? Oh well. Space exploration can be cruel. Now, what else is there? There's this planet over here. Just checking out my time. 
Right, this is going to be a sudden, sudden crash landing if I'm not careful. fuel I like discovery I'm not sure what that is Is it? I'll just leave that pile there if that's all there is. Stay away from the sun. I think it's time for a Z jump, really, unless unless there's something noteworthy that I've missed. I don't think there is. How far are we from Earth then? That's the question. Oh, right. Let's, let's quickly go for intercept. planet we are coming in on a tight course Again, it's very weak gravity this. No wonder it was difficult to land actually. Have that. <gasps> I've got to be careful with jumping on this then. If it's such low mass, have I it's weird but have I like shifted it out of orbit? Oh god. Looks like it, doesn't it? Because Oh you 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 get where's the ship? Managed to get that scroll. What's this here? Well, 
else is going on here? You know. How are they managing to maneuver around so quickly? They don't seem to be following. Oh well. There's ships everywhere, isn't there? to line up just really just crashed into that planet there look at that, look at that one with the hat on message from merchant thank you I don't know what the what I've done allegedly When I throw that object, I should have s some sort of recoil, shouldn't I? Okay, Google, stop. there but I'm healing anyway I'll just I'll just get this planet done and then get back into orbit I think take one of these aliens take an alien off his home world into orbit right and then I think the only other one I didn't do was this planet over here Let me just pause that there. I'll go and do the rest of my fin food. I was about to say thinner. Dinner. One second.
Okay, so I've got 20 minutes remaining before I have to go and do some other bits and bobs. So let's see what we can get done in that time. This is quite dangerous actually. That alien's peeing me off, but I suppose I am the invading species. Pushing me around. Look at it, pushing that. Right, if we can get over on the other side of this, you shouldn't. shouldn't. How's the ship? It's all right. Oh, God damn it. Just inch down there. Get into orbit. I've already got the the Z drive ready to go. Just fuel, really. Four light years. Hey, what's that there? Music's pretty cool. Oh, that planet's rotation means it's got a permanent dark side. Get on the planet first before that. Get on that flashing thing in the asteroid cluster. What's that? Power off. No, thank you. Uh, I can't imagine that something so close to the solar system star has got such weak gravity on it. Well, maybe. There it is. I can't te I can't tether it back to the ship though. Dissect it.
Now, where is that flashing object? There's a few. What's this thing here? Oh, the Z drive's done. I'm sort of pleased about that because I'm I, I thought this was gonna be a real tough toughie this one. It's not not a lot happening really. Five years, five light years on our journey. Get straight into orbital insertion with having done nothing. Sweet, good landing. Not a lot going on here, actually. I don't know, there is another one. Again, it's like it's rotationally locked with a permanent dark side, is it? It seems to be. Oh my god, I can't see what's going on here. Okay, some damage on the old ship there. Seems a bit risky that to me. Right. It's the nature of this universe, everything rotates clockwise. So in which case, being as we're in a slower orbit path, we might as well go counterclockwise. See what we can see.
Oh, what? How bad is it? Pretty bad. Let's hope we get some fuel on this planet. <gasps> Doesn't look like fuel to me though. Uh oh. <laughs> EVA suit, orbital insertion and landing. Here we go. This is how you do it. I survived. This little guy's a survivor. Oh, sugar. get though there's, there's nothing on this planet oh, we're gonna have to really tap that thing can I run up this one I don't really want to hit the jump key see <gasps> there doesn't seem to be a lot going on the planet this planet Oh, what's this? I'll have that. Whatever that is, I can't get hold of it. I'm just a bit concerned about the old fuel reserves. Let's loop in. Oh, 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 what have we got here? This is terrible I'm to navigate this asteroid field. Look how close we are to the planet. 135 degrees. I mean, I, I presume I have the shield in. The whole asteroid field is orbits decaying into the sun. I'm stuffed, but so far we're okay. Still quite a bit off. 
I think we're going to need to land on the planet again, but I can't remember which planet I landed on. There's three planets. I think, oh, I, when I jumped into the system. See, this isn't good. I'm going to burn a lot of fuel trying to catch up with that planet. Let's just let's orbit the opposite way around. Let's, let's just hope we don't crash into an asteroid. I mean, I don't know how it handles that. Okay, okay. Um, need to go. Where's, where's the planet? There. So I did crash into an asteroid. I can just get that. Jump drive. Come on. Let's jump out of here before it's, it's way too risky. Sugar. Oh god, jump, jump, jump. Phew. Okay. Let's get EVA. I haven't got the ability to manoeuvre that much. Wind is phenomenal. Let's settle down here. Wind comes again, I am stuffed. Blow me off into orbit. It actually has. My ship's fuel so low, I'm just gonna try and land again using my jetpack. Come on, keep it keeping keeping the atmosphere. <laughs> Is a thing. Okay. No. I'm really down on fuel at the moment. In my EVA suit. Okay, Google, stop. 
get to that ship. Where is it? No. Huh? Let's get in. Get off this planet, good God. Right. Uh, let me just go and check on the situation. One bit a second. Let's see if we're okay. I think we should be alright for five minutes. Yeah, I'm good for, well, not really good. Just, just let's do a nice safe jump from here now. Orbital decay. Okay, that's looking better. Got another planet over there. So let's speed things up a bit. Try and intercept. Such a hostile area, this. Okay, that is really conserving the old fuel. drive online exit with MAD Take off from here. This could be our last jump, you see. Okay, that's hugely good news. Anything really. I've got no fuel there. Look at 
Come here, little green thing. Let me touch you, scan you. What's this? Is that your little thing? But it's mine now. It's my fuel source now. One. Is that it? damaging my health. I have fuel source now. Oh, I can't get over this. Oh, I can. See, the thing is... inevitable can I just come on okay that's good news see what I'm doing here. Is that fuel? If it's fuel, we're all right. Okay, that's been worthwhile. Um, get back into some sort of stable orbit. And we're going to have to really look at this conservatively now. But I'm just a bit concerned about my food being overdone so I think on that basis oh I can't I can't quit out of it then there's no way to like I've had a bit of a nightmare in the past with this space stations, haven't I? What's this thing over here? Is it?
Oh dear. How do you save your game then? Don't think I can. I think I think that's it really. Well that's a bit of a disappointing um isn't it like if you can't actually save your game whilst pausing and just pick it up and resume it but i will get that done i'll just have to like sort of hopefully hope that it saves in there oh okay google stop right i better go okay in a bit